I don't think I threw it away. Wait, didn't I see you on Facebook? What? There's a guy in there, it could be your twin brother. Pretty close. Huh. He sings and stuff on it. It's his dad and him? He swear he's related. I thought, what the heck is he doing? I thought it was you at first. No. Go to camp, sing. He does sing like this, so in the morning when he's getting his teeth brushed, he talks really loud. I got all kinds of freaking projects going. Huh. For ideas for projects. I mean, when does the weather start fucking warm up? Well, it's just better this weekend. Yeah. Tomorrow's Hey buddy, what you doing? Yeah, my cat's on the run playing today, but I said that no. Not today. Suppose the bigger the taller they are, too, the less it can Well, the thing is <coughs> I don't know if I'm gonna use the handle like I do the other one. Or just weld some kind of a here's a hitch on the side. A, 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 a sawtooth tail with a rim. Four dollars ninety five cents a piece. That makes sense. Yeah, how big is it? For by kind of like a it's like for a um dolly. You know? Oh sure, yeah, that would be alright. Five bucks for the entire end of the rim. It's got bearings in it. Yeah. Huh. Or just two pieces. We are four bucks, five bucks, tight. Yeah. Yeah, then you gotta pay shipping, probably. Yeah, then it'd be a okay. hundred bucks. No, it depends on. No, they're, if they're really light, they're probably really light, though. Not yeah, they're plastic. There's no matter. Uh, I could even go with plastic. There's some grippier ones, like pressure washer, right? Five bucks. I'm just trying to get that old pressure washer with that, too. Let's check my inventory. You know, it wouldn't be hard to make a spin either. You could just get a piece of steel on and put a piece of rod and find something in and out that's the right size. And then just fucking take your torch and heat it up and just bend it to an angle. And then. So they wouldn't have to be. You they just gotta be close, you know. You could weld a. Take a washer and weld it on the back side of it so the tire, you know, yeah, the yeah. stopper. Mm -hmm. And then just drill a hole in the spindle for a cottage and you put another washer on there. You could make your own spindles pretty easy. And that way you can make them adjustable. I can't do any work till I get the car and shit out of there. But I want to get, I want to get my uh, idea and my parts together. I 
think I got got the idea now. You help me with the idea. Whether it works or not, I don't know. I think it will. Here. Here. There's some cheap two ninety nine for a little pressure washer. I just probably like the plastic one, you know. Well, for five bucks, you yeah. get that. I better go with plastic. They're kind of a pain in the ass, aren't they? Don't overfill them because that's going to be a ton of good stuff in the book. Yeah. Yeah, you can probably want to go with the better ones then. God, that fucking hurt too. I bet you I had fucking. I bet you it was two weeks before my fucking finger It hurt out. me and it didn't even hit me. Boy, it was all here. I was here when it happened. Oh, really? Yeah. Knocked her right over, man. What size were them ones? Five buck ones? Yeah, I did. Were they 10 inch? 4 by 10? No. Oh, maybe. Or are they four by nine? They're either nine or ten or something. Yeah, the, the you know the grip ones. No, I'm not really worried about the grip either because I'm gonna. Be, no, but the, I'm sure. It's I, it's gonna be swinging from the winch anyway. No, yeah, it's, it's gonna be dragging along. No, yeah, it's gonna be dragging. So yeah, but you probably want, you don't want the tire to wear it out. No, keep changing. You got them sawtooth ones were four ten by four. Yeah, four, four ninety. And the ones with the metal were 10 by 4. How do they measure them? 10 inches high? Probably 10 inches one way and 4 inches the other way. That's probably, prob could be. So the. Uh, and these are cheap. Is they're cheap or cheap? They're steel wheels. This one's a little different. Must be for some kind of snow. Yeah, the 410 is. The cartwheels. Well, I'll check. I'll look at my stock today, too. And they're something good. I'm going to measure that plywood today, too, to see if I can get a straight blade on there. Take the number down and bring it in. We'll see if we can number of what? The model number. Off the five one? Yeah. Let's we'll see if we can. See, it's got the three little bit of plates on it now. Maybe we can get a parts breakdown and see if it has something different. It's up like that. See, the only problem I have with that is would it go down, see, from a winch? Um, so, well, uh, I did it by hand before and something like that. I weighed another pound and take it. That's why I wanted the wheels. Either I could mow up and down like that, or across, or whatever. But anyway, just another thought. I gotta get to work. All right, I'm gonna put you to work one of these days, too. All right. You got a license, something? All right. You got a license? Another boat. Whether I use it or not, I got a license it. I watched the auction last Monday. There was one. Uh, no, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday night's auction. It was um. The you, fucking bolts up at Smith's are not bringing nothing. And that was the one that you were watching. I mean, they were like my little bolts. They went down. Was it the day you? Was it the you watching um John Deere one? I think so. Yeah, you're watching that John Deere. Oh, did Oh, Wednesday I had to go to Eau Claire and then I stopped up there and I I had two bits up there. Yeah, there. You, that was. Oh, well, that's when I got that old beat up mower. I said you were getting that load. Ten dollars. Yeah, twelve dollars. And a little, little boats like mine, you know, they weren't nothing fancy. Boat and trailer and like, you know, make a motor, old motor. You're only bringing like four hundred bucks. I remember when I got mine, I'd drive around. They had a nineteen seventy some boat down the Latin, cross Latin for sale, fifteen hundred bucks. You couldn't find a boat for under fifteen hundred. bucks. Yeah, but also though, you get on Facebook. Anywhere on there, not really up there quite high. Well, the, I mean, the nicer ones like you, you know, but also, like for what I have, just the old fashioned fishing boat, but not really nice. But also, though, it's not boat people aren't thinking about because it's cold, cold out, though. Yeah. But, 
fucking lawnmowers are bringing big money. Though. They are. No, no, you saw that John Gear one, that John Gear DS. I'm sick of about buying something. That but that John, which was the one you seen in Smith that you saw was high? That John Deere D was going for like a thousand bucks. Well, that one that you like you had that you got your sister a long time ago, Craftsman something. I was going yeah, to GT. D something whatever. It was more GT probably. It's probably G. There's it was some it? more on there. No, I looked at John Deere. I know that John Deere D you said went for like a thousand bucks. Oh yeah, that John Deere like D one thirty. They're fucking home. Yeah, they're junk. For junk. So for a thousand dollars. And then there's that Cub Cadet you seen on there went for a thousand bucks. Yeah. Then maybe some craftsmen. Yeah, the one thirties are crap. Then there's probably some, there's probably some craftsmen's other brands went for four or five hundred, ain't they? The fucking transmissions go out. Yeah, I don't know. It's a frenzy out there. <laughs> some people don't care though. They just I got some at Down of Moms. I could sell, but I really don't want to. What the time I do when I'm gonna need it? Yeah, but if it, yeah, yeah, but you could, I got overkill down. There. You could sell the junk or the junk ones, though. Yeah, you no, know, you really need like three of them. No, all you need is zero turn and three forty-five. But no, if you have a zero turn one, and then you, you get the one sixty three forty-five. No, if you have a zero turn one, zero if you turn, then I got that one crash. All you, all you really need is a zero turn one with another junk crash when I use for dry run water plants with. Maybe yeah, put a pump in. It. Oh yeah, if you have like part, if you have one with the snowboard, yeah, you have that. Pump, I yeah. Yeah. You have that yeah. You have that 345 that's a snowboard, and then you have one with a bagger, so all you need is like four or five on Mars. Uh, I got four or five down there, yeah. Plus that nice one I got in the back there. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even think I'm going to mess with that. I might even pull the spindles off that to use that. Take the rest of it. You're done over here and sit here. Oh. Uh, Sell it or whatever. I think you've got some on there. Yeah, I looked at it. Or for an auction, like in a month or so. Oh, and like the very, the very end, the end of May? I was just looking for one. Could be the very end of May. That, that one that we drove out there one day. Smith? No. Oh, I want to see what that John Deere with the bagger was. That's a <laughs> STX 38 or something. Oh, those ones you mean way out in the field. Nice. Yeah, there's the one for a hood. That's a, there's a 318 that's.
That's how you're talking. Yes, no, no, Let me see. 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 Let me see.